Hello and welcome to Asset TV. Joining us now to talk about market performance is Sean McCarthy. He's CEO of Build America Mutual. Sean, this has been an unprecedented quarter, to say the least, with a whole new approach to the workplace and massive volatility in the markets. How has Build America Mutual responded? You know, um, it's been a a really interesting and challenging time in the market. Um, But I can say one thing, we were uh, prepared for the work remote environment. We were fortunate to have set up uh, video conferencing that we use on a daily basis prior to uh, the work remote position. And it, that means that for every analyst and employee in the company, um, they can, we can see each other face to face through uh, video conferencing um, and through a, ch- uh, a thing called Rocket Chat. So um, both uh, enable us to conduct all of our uh, credit committees, uh, meetings with outside uh, uh, investors and members uh, to work out all of our other committees. In fact, our last board meeting was held remotely and all of that worked really well. The thing that's been interesting is that we actually spend more time face to face with each employee than we have in the past. Because we are on a video conference, now we have the entire company once a week on a, on a conference and we meet daily on, on credit issues that uh, need approval and discussions in the secondary market. Some silver linings here. Well, we've been, you know, it's interesting. Uh, it was fortunate. We had a guy, uh, our head of uh, IT is named David McIntyre, and he had, uh, came from BlackRock and did a really spectacular job in uh, putting together uh, a system that is seamless and has worked uh, without any uh, difficulties through this entire period. So it sounds like you fared pretty well. How has the pandemic impacted your business in 2020? So, uh, you know, since March, our business has uh, increased dramatically. Um, and I think that's for a couple of reasons. Um, first, investors are in, uh, incredibly focused on credit um, as it looks like the economy uh, potentially has shut down in different ways. And how that might affect uh, municipalities themselves uh, has prompted uh, investors to look towards the safety of our AA guarantee in order to make their portfolio more secure. Um, so one of the things that we've been doing, uh, we've had a 50% increase in, in uh, our primary market uh, underwritings, uh, totaling $7.7 billion uh, uh, in, the, in the first half of the year. Uh, and that's uh, a dramatic increase. That increase also um, uh, runs to our secondary market uh, business, which is really guaranteeing bonds that didn't come initially with uh, um, credit enhancement or bond insurance on it. Um, we wrap those afterwards for greater security and better trading value and liquidity for the end investor. And can you give us an update on your S&P rating? Uh, sure. Um, at the end of June, uh, Standard & Poor's Global um, released uh, their annual credit review of Build American Mutual. Um, we uh, aff- were affirmed at AA with a stable outlook in the market. And we're particularly gratified by that at this point where the uh, lots of uh, stress in the market relative to municipal port- portfolio performance. But for us, I think we've been getting uh, bigger and stronger and stable as we stick to our knitting of serving that primary market and only that market. Um, so uh, that report, incidentally, is available on our website. Um, there's a direct link to uh, Standard & Poor's uh, so you can uh, read all the details. It was so good, uh, you know, uh, I'd send it to my mother if I, I'm sure she'll appreciate that. And uh, yields on municipal bonds are back to the levels we saw in February and early March after spiking higher at the end of the COVID-19 outbreak. Do you think the market has fully recovered? Um, well, I think right now, you know, the market, if, if, was, uh, if you were measuring its, uh, what it felt, you'd say that, yes, it must be recovered tremendously because uh, rates are lower and spreads are tighter. Um, than they have been since uh, before the COVID-19 uh, started to take hold of the market. But what I would say is that, um, you know, the sensitivity towards credit performance uh, is still a real issue. Um, and I think that that will become more and more important in the third quarter, the fourth quarter, and even into the beginning of next year. And what I mean by that is that revenue streams for municipalities are going to be stressed. So if you count on a certain amount of tax basis to come in, 
or uh, sales tax in some circumstances, or if you have a convention center and you can't have conventions, all of those things are going to influence what happens to credits going forward. Now at BAM, we've been focused on our members. We're a mutual insurance company, which means we really, our stakeholders are the municipalities that take our insurance. And we've been working with them long in advance of uh, what might be a stressful situation for them to make sure we can help, make sure that they're prepared, and make sure that we are transparent with both to the market. Finally, Sean, what's your outlook for the rest of the year? Uh, so, uh, you know, I think two things are going to happen, potentially. Um, one, I think there's going to be a heightened uh, awareness of credit performance. So at BAM, we focus on essential public purpose uh, municipalities. So it's schools, state and local governments, um, water treatment plants, really what we think of as classic um, municipal finance. And we only do business uh, in that sector and we only do business in the United States. So what we think will happen is that the uh, retail and institutional investors will both be driven towards focusing on security in their portfolios. And I think our role in the market will be greater in the second half of the year, uh, even though the second quarter was really terrific. Um, I think our ability to serve the market will increase dramatically as people are sensitive to these trends that are going to happen. Um, and, and, and in most cases, those revenue streams lag uh, public, uh, public awareness. Well, Sean, great to have you. Thank you so much for your time. Yep, you're welcome. It's really a pleasure to be here. And thank you for watching. That was Sean McCarthy, CEO of Build America Mutual. I'm Jenna Dagenhart for Asset TV.